I had a pretty dismal skate session this morning. I sort of chalked it up to a few things. First, I haven't skated for a few weeks since I've been surfing, and the surf last week was pretty good, and I got beat up pretty good. It was a bigger swell than expected to be, and thus a lot of my session was getting a beat down. On top of being beat up from having hit the bottom a few times, bailing, I decided to put together a new deck and skate a new pair of shoes at the same time. And as exciting as it is to have a new deck and new shoes, every skater knows that that combination makes it difficult to get a feel for your board. So I sort of knew what I was getting into this morning with a hole in my foot, testing out a new deck and new shoes all at once. So I decided not to be too hard on myself for being a bit off today. I just tried to get through the motions. I was listening to the most recent Jordan Peterson podcast, and towards the end of the podcast, Jordan gets into the notion of being your authentic self. He spoke in lane about representing yourself truthfully and precisely to others so that you don't get in the habit of projecting an image of yourself of whom you do not actually represent. And this, for better or for worse, has been my guiding philosophy throughout my life. People know who they're getting. And for better or for worse, I've dealt with the consequences of not being fake. And as hard as it can be, being who you are, unapologetically. It's far worse to be fake. And that's what Jordy got into in this discussion. The problem with faking it in life is eventually one day you wake up and you are uncertain about exactly who you are. I've come to know many fakes and phonies throughout my life and I always wondered how they got away with themselves. In retrospect, however, I don't think anyone gets away with faking anything in life, even if they can fake it long enough to believe it for a short period. Reality has a certain cruel way of snapping back. And I think humanity collectively currently is going through a period of the universe snapping back as fakes and snakes are being exposed in digital time and digital speed. And though there's yet a fight ahead of us for someone who has kept it real, it's certainly an exciting time to be alive.